Well, Drew Lachey is a man of many talents. He's a member of 98 Degrees. He's a Broadway veteran, has his own theatrical camp, and he's also affiliated with Camp Joy. Plus, we cannot forget his return to Dancing with the Stars, Dancing with the Stars, excuse me, on the All Star Edition. So here we are, Drew Lachey joining us in the studio. Drew, thank you so much for joining us. My pleasure. And, and you know, sometimes after spicy food, it's returning Dancing to the Stalls too. You know, it's just, it, all, it all depends depends on what you have for dinner. So how is that going? Are you having fun being back? On Absolutely. the All Star Edition. Absolutely. I mean, the Dancing with the Stars has kind of become a, a second home for me. Um, I, I filled in as guest host. I've I've been the judge. I've gone back and done my freestyle there. God knows how many times. Um, so it really is just kind of a, a home away from home for me, and I'm having a lot of fun. I got a great partner, Anna Trubunskaya, and we are just uh, we're having a good time dancing together. So let me just uh, you know inform the viewers too that you were actually you were a winner in yes. the second season, and so now you're back for the All Stars. Is it hard having a new partner to get used to, or does that make it more fun? Or you know what's the dynamic there? A little bit of both. I mean, at first, obviously, it's it's an adjustment. You know, it's like okay, I'm driving a new car here. How does it feel? How Fast, hard to step on the brakes before it stops, all that kind of stuff. We'll make um, sure Anna knows you just compared her to a car. But. Well, no, she, that's, that's me. She compares me to a Mini Cooper like okay. every day. She's like, you're small, you're fast, you're powerful, that you're a Mini Cooper. I'm like, thank you? It's kind of like, how does she like to be held in frame? You know, mm -hmm. which where does she like the hand? Which underarm turn, outside turn, whatever, whatever the her personal preferences are. So once you learn that, learn her teaching style, um, the way she likes to run a rehearsal, then it's, you know, it's all fun. How much of a role does like you said, looking at the camera play there too, because you're not just dancing, you're also performing for the audience, you're performing for the judges and millions of people that are watching at home. Yeah, in, in week one, I, I really made a concerted effort. I was like, all right, I'm gonna go out there. They always said stuff about my frame in season two, so I'm really gonna go out and I'm gonna try and do the foxtrot the best I can, just have it be technically sound and perfect. Went out and it wasn't really necessarily everything I could do to be me. Um, so I, I think there is a, a, a large element of, okay, you got to ham it up. You got to put a lot more elements of your own personality in there as far as just saying, all right, well, this is, if I was watching a ballroom competition, this is what I'd see. Cause it's not that. You two were in the bottom two. Yeah. Right. After the first week. So what are you going to do now to, to come back? I mean, we have actually, I have a tweet here and this one from your bro oh said, no way it should have been that close for the Drew Lachey tonight on Dancing with the Stars. Next week, you all got to vote like crazy. No mercy. That's right, and and I, I would agree with him. There's not very many times that I agree with my brother, but that is one of them. <laughs> um, so it really was kind of a, an eye-opener, a shock. Um, that being said, I'm just gonna go out and, and try and do Gotta my best. Gotta do your best. Yeah, I can't control who's voting for me. All I control is you know what I put on the dance floor and whether they're gonna enjoy it. All right, so. can you do me a favor? Since sure. you since you came here with uh, with all of your dancing skills, now can you show me a little move? Teach me one. All right, absolutely. Okay. Um, let's do. What are we gonna do? What's what's a good one? Um, a little cha cha. A little cha cha. Right. Okay, yeah. I am by no means a professional dancer. So you're gonna Sorry, have to help me with this I. one. Sorry, neither am I. All right. So basically, you, you don't do anything on the first count. All right. Okay. So on the second count, you're gonna step backwards with your right foot. Yep. And then you come come forward, all and right. then. Cha cha cha, and okay. then you're gonna come forward, forward oh, with forward. your left foot, and then back, and cha cha cha, cha, cha. cha. back, forward, cha cha cha, forward, mm -hmm. back, cha cha cha, back, oh, man. forward, I'm cha cha cha, I'm gonna get made fun of for this. Forward, back, cha cha cha. No more than me. I have to wear rhinestones and spray tanning <laughs> and do it. So you know, it's all good. Da da da. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cha cha cha. There you go. And then you throw in a that couple twists. Fun. And you can do that a in a club. Spin. Exactly. Oh, you want, we can do a spin. No, no, no. We're good. We're throw good. Throw a little dip in there. We can. We can. We can. We are good for now. But we thank can burn you. A I hole in this it. Rug. I, I need to stop before something bad happens <laughs> and I really embarrass myself. Ninety-eight degrees. Yes. You guys are reuniting, going at it again ten years later. It feels so good. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, we are. We're getting back together. We did one show in August um, at the Mixtape Festival in Hershey, Pennsylvania, and it was us and Kelly Clarkson, the New Kids on the Block, the Fray, LL Cool J, the Wanted, like a huge, huge music festival. And, um, you know, they called us up and asked us if we wanted to be a part of it. And we were like, yeah, sure, why not? You know, we'll, we'll dust off our boy band moves and see what we got. Um, and then it really just snowballed from there to the point where we're like, we need to start doing this again. We miss it. We want to make music together again. Um, so after Dancing with the Stars and um, after Nick's able to get some sleep from you know having a newborn. That's right, he just um, had a kid. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna get back in the studio and make some new music and then hopefully uh, 2013, we're gonna get back out on tour again. Well, do you feel like that lends itself to, uh, do you have more material you know, as, as a band now or as a group to write about? You're, you all are a little older, many of you have families. Uh, are you saying you we're know? old? 